All right, so tonight's spiral review is what are the first two multiples that three and nine have in common? One of the first things that kids need to remember are some of the vocabulary words. They really need to know what multiples mean. That is, using a particular factor, all the possibilities you can make with it. It's kind of like skip counting. All right, I'm going to show you the multiples of three. So we would start by listing them out. Three begins the range, then it's six, nine, twelve, 15, 18, 21, 24, 27, and 30. I'm going to do the same thing for 9 and see if there's enough of them to find in common. So it would be 9, sorry about that, 9, 18, 27, 36, 45. I'm not going to keep going because I have some pretty high numbers. So I want to know ones that they have in common, because that's, again, what the question was asking. Well, my first factor is 9, it's also my first multiple, and it's the third multiple of the number 3. When I keep looking, I'm looking to see if they have 18, and they do. So these are the first two multiples they both have in common. So they would just write it out, the first two multiples. And again, we want to get them also used to writing complete sentences so that their answer is clear. The first two multiples of 3 and 9 are 9 and 18. So there they've done. They've shown their work, and they've given us a complete answer for everything that we needed for this question.